behind these closed doors at Jail North in Mecklenburg County. Especially for 16 and 17 year olds. It's the exact same teachers, exact same curriculum. Learning never stops. We have to show them that there is rewards for education. The Mecklenburg County Sheriff's Office works with communities and schools to make sure teens, even after being arrested, don't miss a day of school. This program is vital. LaDante Lee is with communities and schools. I meet with them on a one-on-one -on -one basis and find out, you know, who they are as individuals and what what are their goals, what are some of the obstacles that they're facing, and how I might be able to remove some of those barriers. Dorian Johnson at the Sheriff's Office told us the goal is to help youthful offenders graduate. Education is one of the best predictors of who will land in some type of criminal problem. The latest study from the State Sentencing Policy Advisory Commission found statewide recidivism rates have remained consistent over the last five years or so, with about 42 to 45 percent of juveniles becoming repeat offenders. But in Mecklenburg County, at least anecdotally. The actual graduates, we don't see them pretty much at all. Johnson and Lee believe their programs are working and helping teens make better decisions in the long run. I do not think it's impossible to change. For me, I get to see many of them at Walmart, at the grocery store, and they yell out, hey, Mr. Johnson, and I see them with their kids. And for me, that's the goal of this program. In Charlotte, Eugene Cho, Spectrum News.